The purpose of the Rule Set Manager is for creation of customized rule sets for checking in Salibri. The Rule Set Manager can be found from the File tab by selecting the Rule Set Manager button at the bottom. The interface for the Rule Set Manager is a separate interface from the rest of Salibri. Notice the windows in the Rule Set Manager include a Rule Set Folders window and a Libraries window. From the Libraries window, we can explore all the possible templates that can be used for rule creation in Salibri. We can select a rule set from the rule sets folders window or a rule template from the libraries window. And by doing so, we show the info about that rule set or template on the right hand side in the info window. You'll also notice a question mark next to each of the rule templates. By selecting the question mark, we can load a detailed description of how each template behaves and it's intended to be used in Salibri. As we select individual rules or templates, we'll also see the parameters listed in the parameters window. At bottom left is the workspace. This is where we'll create a custom rule set. The rule set manager is used by creating new rule sets in the workspace and then adding any needed rule templates or parts of other rule sets to our new custom rule set. If we're beginning with blank templates, we must first drag those templates into our new rule set and add any parameters that apply to the check we intend to run. For example, if we intend to build a rule for intersection or clash detection, we would choose the general intersection template and drag that template in. And then once it's in our new rule set, we can edit the parameters. Another example is borrowing a component of another rule set and including those components in our new custom rule set. To do this, we highlight any section we're interested in running and add that to our new rule set. Notice that in this case, our parameters have already been set up, and so we've saved ourselves the trouble of recreating parameters that have already been created. We can, of course, select any rule in the rule set and edit the info in the info window to describe the intent and the functionality of that rule. We can do the same thing with our rule set name, description, author, etc. Once we are satisfied with the rule set we've created, we can save as, which will create a C set a file that can be used on any model loaded in Salibri. To run our new rule set, we'll go back into Salibri Model Checker, go to the Checking tab, load our new rule set, and hit the Check button. 